Hey there, thank you for watching this clip on evaluating this integral here. Let's get started. This is a, one of the really interesting problem. Um, if you take a look at this one, we want to find an antiderivative. If we take a derivative of 2, 1 plus x, you'll see this one actually equal to what we're trying to integrate. So the answer we know should be this one. It's 2 times 1 plus x uh, half. If we take derivative of this one, that's equal to 2 times half times 1 plus x to the minus half. As you can see, it's 1 over 1 plus x. Now, if you see this and you know this, of course, the answer is going to be this whole thing equal to 2 plus square root of 1 plus x. But if you don't see this, let's see how we're actually going to derive it. Let's use substitution u is equal to radical of 1 plus x. Okay, so then du is equal to um, derivative of 1 plus x to the half. Okay. It's, I found it's over the years, it's easier to write in the exponents. So it's half 1 plus x to the minus half dx. Okay. Now we're going to write a dx in terms of du so we can do the substitution. I have dx equal to 2 times 1 plus x of uh, positive half du. Okay, now let's substitute it back in there. Let's be careful with our upper bound and lower bound because the variable is still in the x. x equal to 0, x equal to 8. We're going to change this later on. Um, du, dx is equal to du times 2 times 1 plus x to the half. Okay, And then we're going to divided by uh, radical of, which is really u here. So 1, let's see, didn't quite do this one right. So dx is equal to this whole thing, du, and then we can put a u here, or we can actually just write our 1 plus x to the half, because okay, they end up canceling anyway. Okay. This is what the original is. This whole thing on top is dx, end up canceling there. Okay. Now, x is equal to 0, x equal to 8. We can change the boundary here now, but let's for now, let's take care of this one in there. This, this the whole thing is dx. So now all I have left inside is 2 times du, because the whole thing top here is my dx over here. And this one is what I had before on the bottom is my variable u. It's getting interesting. So this is equal to 2 and then times 1. And so basically, since we're doing the du here, 2 times u, and then let's evaluate. u is equal to radical 1 plus x. So when x equal to 0, we have u equal to 1. When x equal to 8, we have u equal to 3, because it's a radical 1 plus 8, which is 3. So u, lower bound is 1, upper bound is 3. And that's Evaluate this one. This is 2, 3 minus 1. So our final answer is 4. This is a really interesting problem. So that's how we handle evaluate this integral we're given. It's basically integral of 1 over radical 1 plus x. Hope it's clear. Please comment on YouTube. Let me know if it's helped you. Hi, this is Dr. Pan, host of Tucson Math Talk channel on YouTube inviting you to subscribe so you can get more math answers. Together, we can make math fun and easy. Until next time, have a confident day.